first thing you want to do is troubleshoot your power pack with a voltmeter. Take the end of your DC jack power adapter and we're going to test it with a meter to make sure it's working before you diagnose your laptop. As you can see this DC power adapter is 19.53 volts so this connector and power pack are in good shape. Notice the DC jack when you wiggle it the power light will come on, go off, go on, go off, go on, go off. So this is telling you that we have a bad connection inside the laptop computer of this HP. This HP, by the way, is the HP G60, and it's going to need a new a DC jack. When you wiggle it, the light goes on, off, on, off, on, off. This will need to be serviced. The whole case and assembly will have to come apart to repair this DC jack. Notice the light. Off, on, off, on. So this DC jack right here is going to need some work. And here we have the DC jack apart from the unit. The unit is totally disassembled. And here is the bad DC jack right here. This is called a CTO DC jack. And we're going to replace this with a brand new one. And this unit will be up and running in about a good hour or so. Here we didn't have the CTO plug-in jack, but we do have the exact DC jack needed to fix this. We have to solder and heat shrink all these components and then reinstall it in the HP G60. And this is the DC jack with a built-in LED power indicator. Okay, here we have the DC jack ready to be soldered onto the CTO plug for the HP G60. Now the DC jack is all soldered, heat shrunk, and ready for installation. There it is. Brand new DC jack solder job. All set to go. And here we go. Here's the DC jack. We're going to plug in the DC jack. And let's see what happens when we plug it in. Light comes on. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Light is still staying on. That means the DC jack is now fixed. No more power going out. Look at that. You can wiggle it all you want. The light stays on. The DC jack is good. And for the boot up. Screen boots up. And let's see what the password is. Thank you.